every act is an act of love or a cry for help. Mm. And to me, that's like, I can apply that everywhere intellectually and from a distance. The thing that lives side by side is what I'm exploring now around nervous system. Like in the moment, my intellect may not be online. My intellect may not be the one in charge of my response, my impulses. And so those two things have to live in concert or it doesn't matter. I can have the knowledge, but if I can't have the practice in my body of staying regulated, I'm going to have a perception of danger and be speaking from that place. Even if an intellectual part of me is like, this person needs love right now. And it's not to say that, I mean, I have a part of me that wants to be perfect in this for sure. So it has to be a practice of like noticing that and little by little marrying those two things. Like I know this moment deserves love. How can my system be a support to that so that my energy, my tone, my words, like all the choices I make in this moment also are coming from my regulated, grounded self, which could be very alive, but certainly from a place that doesn't feel afraid of this moment going bad or being bad.